Sky Soto will literally cross oceans and mountains to play in the NBA. The 16-year-old 7'2 high school prodigy recently announced that he will be leaving the country as he chases this goal. But when exactly did he realize that his dream was within reach? Leno Lavario has the answer. The sky's the limit for Kai Soto has long been said about the towering young stud. Now the 16-year-old star has decided to reach up and chase his dream to be the first homegrown Filipino player to make it to the NBA. inspiration sa kabataan parang ang mga Pilipino pala pwede pala sa ganyan klase competition. The idea of actively pursuing that dream began last year in the FIBA Under-16 Asian Championship in Foshan, China. And it grew and grew during the FIBA Under-17 World Cup in Argentina and the FIBA Under-18 Asian Championship in Thailand. Sabi ko kay Kai, ito yung test mo para makita natin kung hanggang saan ka. So magkita naman yung pinakita niya, merong mga times na na-outstrength siya kasi mahina pa yung katawan niya. So, sabi ko sa sarili ko, tsaka sabi ko rin kay Kai, kailangan lang talaga lumakas yung katawan mo. The former PBA player even recalled the time opponents made fun of the lanky Kai in the FIBA Under-16 Asian Championship, only for Kai to begin establishing himself as he lorded over the tournament's efficiency, blocking, and rebounding departments, leading Batang Gilas to a semi-finals finish and a spot in the FIBA Under-17 World Cup. May katawanan talaga nila, so parang... Okay, sige. Okay lang yan. And then, andun yung game. 2020 siya. Muntik pa tayong manalo. After noon, hanggang sa under, under, under 18, pag nakikita nila si Kai, hindi na sila nagtatawanan. Nagkakapapicture pa sa kanya. And then the offers from the European ball clubs came, including Real Madrid, FC Barcelona, Basconia and Movistar Estudiantes in Spain, and Alba Berlin in Germany. Although Irvin and Kai said they will head to USA first to train starting in Atlanta for two months, it isn't clear yet where Kai will go next. Malalaman natin yan dun sa East West Private. Yung team namin ni Kai na maghahawak sa kanya. Ano ba yung worth ng anak ko sa inyo? Yun ang gusto ko malaman. East West Private is also the agency representing naturalized Filipino and former Nets player Andre Blatch. Pero kung tatanungin si Coach Irvin, mas gusto ba niyang maglaro si Kai ng college basketball sa US o sa Europe? Nakikita ko, pag nanonood ako ng mga NBA, una-una, yung mga lumalabas ng mga European players ngayon, parang ganun yung skill set eh. So parang sabi ko, pwede siguro siya maging ganun. Pero hindi naman siya magiging katulad ni Zion Williams, so alam mo yun. So nakikita ko is parang European style of play yung... Coach Irvin also guarantees that wherever Kai may land, he will return for national team duties. Sa kontrata na pinirmahan namin ni Kai, o pipirmahan namin sa anumang club o sa US, number one priority namin yung Gilas. While Kai anticipates an experience nothing short of easy when he leaves the country with his dad. Sabi na lang dad ko sa akin na hindi ito magiging madali, magiging mahirap to. Pero sabi niya rin sa akin na hindi mo makukuha lahat ng magagandang bagay kung hindi mo paghirapan. Kailangan lang ma-break yung barrier na merong Pilipino na, na nagpursige, na ipinanganak din sa Pilipinas, na nag-NBA, na, 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 na and then naglaro doon at umagal. Lahat titingin ng lahat dito sa, sa mga Pilipino na Oh, may mga ganitong player para sa Pilipinas.